The Undiagnosed Disease Network is a unique project that we have the privilege to be involved in. It allows us to make a maximum effort to try to get a diagnosis for the most difficult medical mysteries. It does that by bringing together scientists who may be working in the laboratory on model organisms, clinicians who are seeing the patient, and geneticists who are studying the DNA, all to work on getting a solution for the patient. The Undiagnosed Diseases Network uses model organisms such as the fruit fly to test whether or not a mutation or variant they find in a person's DNA is causing their disease. In the fruit fly, we typically remove the fly gene and replace it with the normal copy of the human gene. If the normal copy of the human gene can rescue the fruit fly phenotype, then we can test the variants that have been identified in the patients. If the variants identified in the patients fail to rescue, the loss of the function in the fruit fly, we have provided evidence that the variants cause the disease. Through the use of the fruit fly technology, in 2016, we were able to identify a new condition called the hypotonia ataxia and delayed development syndrome. This not only provided answers to the families, but it also allowed them to form their own family advocacy group, providing a supportive structure. Dr. Wengler with genetics and myself with child neurology was able to form the world's first uh, multidisciplinary clinic for this condition, leading to improved clinical diagnostics and now active research in our laboratory setting with fruit flies and mice at the Neurological Research Institute. Search for the Undiagnosed Diseases Network online to learn more.